Hello, my friends. This is Diane at The Creative Bohemian. I had started making this table lamp for my Bohemian Art Studio room box, and I did film it, but due to uh, technical difficulties, I lost that footage. So I'll just explain to you how far I got. Um, this is the base and what it is, is I have glued together a series of jewelry findings and a 1 8 wide brass tube. And I glued it all together with this cement, which is good for metal and wood. And now I'm gonna to continue to finish it so that I can paint it and light it and then make a shade for it. Now, I'm going to use for the rest of it a super glue. And because this is a little thinner than I would like, I'm going to be using this plastic bead that has a nice carving pattern in it. And this is a piece of plastic tubing that I found, I believe this was part of a pen. When I when pens run out of ink, I take them apart and I keep the pieces in order to make other miniatures with them. So this p plastic piece fits right in here. And then I'm gonna place that over there. But first I wanna glue it all together and then I'll put it over the brass tubing. This is the lighting set that I'm going to be using. This very tiny bulb attaches to the two wires the red and the black. This is the battery pack. I'll turn it on. And as you see, when I touch the red wire to the red wire and the black wire to the black wire, it should light up. There we go. So that's what I'm gonna be using for the lamp. I'm gonna thread that through. And there we go, all the way through. And I don't want this bulb, since it's so tiny, to come out. I'm gonna put a little bit of super glue at the top to hold it in place. I'm going to use this plastic piece that comes with the batteries for our lighting um, switch. So I had two lithium batteries, three volt batteries, and I cut out the one plastic piece and I'm going to put that on here. I'm going to glue it on and that will have some place for our lampshade to sit. I'm using enamel paint. This is Testers, which is model railroad paint, hobbyist paint. So I'm using enamel because we are working with both metal and plastic. And this is like a metallic midnight blue. Let's see how it works.
And here is a copper metallic. So now I'm going to glue down this acetate piece down onto there and make the lampshade. I'm going to put along the edge a natural fiber rope both the top and the bottom but very least at the top so it makes it look finished